Your website speed is crucially important to your online success. And if your website is not loading fast enough, it can lead to lost opportunities. For instance, Google might penalize you and decide not to rank your website as high as it normally should. And also, from your visitor's point of view, it might become frustrating to a point where they decide to look elsewhere. So either way, you'll be on the losing end. So today we are going to cover seven different practical ways to increase your WordPress website speed. My name is Dave with Varpex, so let's get started. So what is a good loading time for your website? Well, based on SEMrush, a trusted SEO resource, one to two seconds is a good loading speed for your website. Now, having said that, if your website is loading under four seconds, you're still doing better than most websites on the internet. So how can you check your website's loading speed? And for this, you can use different tools. So you have pingdom.com, you have GT Metrics, for instance, but for this, we are going to use Google's own PageSpeed test a tool, which is the PageSpeed Insights. So let's click on this. And from here, you need to enter your URL. So let's try this with our own website, verpex.com. Okay. And let's click Analyze. And the results are out. As you can see, we have a page speed score of 98, which is excellent, obviously, you know. So you would aim to be over 90, which is considered good by Google. And as you can see, the loading time is 0.8 seconds, which again is absolutely fantastic and very good, obviously, you know. So you would aim to be between one and two seconds, which is good. But anything below four seconds would be considered good compared to the rest of all the websites on the internet. So now let's consider the first aspect to speed up your website, which is your theme. So basically every website uses a theme in order to tweak the layout and customize the outcome and the front end of your website. So as you can see here, the most popular ones would be Astra. We have Ocean WP, Hello from Elementor, Neva. We also have Cadence, Generate Press. So these are the most popular ones. Now, the only downside with custom themes is that they use third party page builders such as Elementor, you have Divi, you have Beaver Builder, uh, WP Bakery. These are the most popular ones. But the only downside with these is that they add weight to your website. It takes much more time to load. Now, if at all possible, I would highly recommend that you use the built-in page builder in WordPress, which is Gutenberg. So Gutenberg, uh, which has come a long way since its inception, is almost equally as good as any other page builders nowadays. So when choosing a theme, make sure that this one is compatible with Gutenberg. So for instance, Astra here is compatible with Elementor, Beaver Builder, Breezy, but also Gutenberg. And once you can tick that box, you are guaranteed that your website will load super fast. Which leads us nicely to our second point of optimization, your plugins. So all WordPress websites would use a certain amount of plugins, a few anyways. So here we have a demo website. As you can see, we have an anti-spam plugin, SEO for migration for Google Analytics and so on and so on. So the first thing you want to make sure is not to overload your website with too many plugins, unnecessary plugins. So if there are some plugins that you're not using, you can simply delete them. So as you can see, we're not using this one. You can click delete. Okay, and that's it. This is going to save on resources already. The next step is to make sure that all your plugins are up to date. So as you can see, this one is not up to date. So we can click on update now. And within a few seconds, our plugin will be updated. As you can see, it's done now. Now, one essential plugin you should always install on your website in order to increase the performances and the loading time of your WordPress website is to use a caching plugin. So we have Lightspeed Cache installed here, but you can also use WP Rocket, which is the number one WordPress caching plugin. And as you can see, this will increase your loading time and also your score. Now, in line with a caching plugin, you can also optimize your images because heavy images obviously take time to load, which will impact your score and your page load time. So for this, you can use Imagify here. As you can see, this is to optimize images and convert WebP. So what is WebP? WebP is a new dedicated image extension. So we used to have JPEG images, PNG images, etc., etc. And now there's a new dedicated extension, which is WebP, which is much more optimized for speed and loading time. Now, all WordPress websites are run using CSS and JavaScript. Now, some are hosted on your own website and some are third-party scripts. 
Now, when they host it on your own website, you can use plugins to help minify those scripts. And also with CSS, very often your theme will come with several CSS sheets, which can be combined in just one. And again, WP Rocket mentioned earlier is the perfect tool for this. Now, if you're using third party scripts, such as analytics trackers, for instance, uh, these can add extra load to your website, obviously, and unfortunately you have no control over these. So choosing the fastest provider would probably be your best option in this case. And the next solution is by using Cloudflare. So Cloudflare is a very well-known and trusted company that will help you not only to secure your website, but also to make it much faster. And all this thanks to their CDN service. So CDN stands for Content Delivery Network. So a content delivery network will make your website faster by having copies of your website hosted on different servers worldwide. So if your business is based, let's say in Europe, but you have customers worldwide, if someone from the US tries to reach your website, Cloudflare will redirect that client to the nearest server, like for instance, New York or Texas maybe. And this way, your customers won't experience any delays. And finally, obviously, your web host is one of the main reasons why your website is either super fast or as slow as a snail. So let's go to our Vorpex website here. As you can see, you can select among different plans. There's loads to choose from. You can choose cloud hosting, WordPress specific hosting or managed servers. But one thing is guaranteed with Verpex, you will always get optimal performances. So there you go, guys. That's all for now. I hope you found this helpful. If so, please consider giving us a thumbs up and share with all of your friends. Now, feel free to subscribe to our channel as well for more of these practical tips.